Hey, what is up guys? Back again with another one. Alright, so today I'm going to show you how to uh, rotate out the different um, icons that are in the top of your notification bar or the quick toggle. I think they're quick toggle settings. So, as you can see there, so what you want to do is you want to pull down the notification bar. Let's try to get this in focus. Alright, there we go and you want to try to pull it down again which will bring down more um, icons and toggle switches and stuff and if you don't like the ones that you currently have in here you can switch them out for example I don't do a whole lot of flying so I don't really need to use airplane mode so what you want to do is once you click that pencil up here at the top once you click that it'll bring you to another screen so like I said before, I don't use, I don't do a whole lot of flying, so I can take this airplane mode out. So what you want to do is you want to hold it and then drag it down to whichever one that you want in its place. Or, or and then pick another one, I guess. And then now you just switched it out. So say for instance, if I didn't have my phone or, or didn't have my charger I can switch on the battery saver and what else do we got here that I don't really use uh, the rest I really do kinda use so I'll just keep the rest up there but like I said before if you don't uh, if you want to change the icons and the toggle switches you just hold it and it'll select it and you drop it and then you just pick another one Let's go with do not disturb and then drop it and then there you go and now you just officially switched the the switches or the icons up here at the top in your notification bar so once again what you want to do pull the notification bar down um, pull it down again and you can see which of the 10 icons that you have uh, available and then if you don't like those hit the pencil click drag drop and then click another one and put it back in its place and then if you don't like uh, what you had before you just can click reset and it'll reset it itself and that's pretty much it and I'll catch you guys in the next one